Hi, Cute Creatures X here, and as you can see from what's in front of you, I'll be doing a video today on hamster supplies that I have and like the organisation where well, you can't really see the organisation. But it is obviously all in these like plastic ones which fit in a grey container, which I'm sure you've all seen. It's the ones you get from Wilkinson's. First off, I apologise for any background. Or well, the background you see here, obviously we don't have a car, but it's a bit ugly. And any background you noise know, you may hear from Oscar and downstairs and next door's dog. They're quite loud at the minute. So first off the supplies I have is obviously these are the main treats that are out. Obviously there is more which I will show you later. And this is just in the container which you get from B and M, which is a pound. And obviously they're just stackable and then here we have I would have showed this in my treat video that is currently up if you go if you want to see the treats go and watch that. But this is just some of the treats we have in there. Then I have a few dog biscuits, I do need to get some more though. I have the Bonio meaty chips and the Maribone rolls. For, set, for the same sprees. I do need to get some more because it is the only thing that Joey actually chews. So I'm, it's important that I have them to keep his teeth down. Here is the cleaning supplies. There's not actually a lot in here. This is a cleaning drawer. So we have the hamster bedding. We have a blue one and then a purple one. I have so much of the minute because currently Joey's not using it in his house, he prefers not to use it, so I'll just keep it. I will add some, I will add it in the winter, whether he likes it or not, just to keep him warm, obviously. At the moment, it's quite warm in here anyway, so it's not too bad. Then we'll just have rubber gloves for cleaning out cages, and Oscar's cage. So that's just general. This isn't all obviously a house, so this is just general stuff. Then we have two of the Bob Mars and My Little Friend disinfectant. One is nearly empty. Bottle brush cleaner. Water bottle holder. And a finger groomer that I've not actually used. Then the next things we have here are, again, like accessories, essentials. So this one, the first thing we have is the hamster nuggets, which is part of his diet, with just a bag clip on. And the rest of his food, you can't see it, but it is on the top of his cage, and there's obviously some toys in his cage that you won't see. They'll be in the cage tour. This is just half a bag of nuggets that he has. And the next thing is very important and everyone should have one, it is a house to carry. If you don't have one, I suggest going out and buy one. You really need to make sure you have one in storage somewhere because you never know when you're going to need it. If like vets or moving house or just keeping it somewhere safe um, for cleaning if your hamster doesn't like exercise ball. This is just, I think this is a rosewood one but I'm not sure. And it is still got, that's pretty bad, it's still got some wood shavings in from when I moved in April. That obviously moved Joey. So you can get these for about five, six pounds, depending where, so it's important that you always have one of them. Then we're on to houses, there's a random toy which should be never draw a bit, it doesn't fit because I need more storage, I've got too much. It's just houses, so we've got a woodman's tunnel. The bit to the plastic seesaw thing. A strawberry house which Joey no longer fits in but will be used for the future house because they'll be smaller. A pink house which is only a, is a spare for rescues. It was for my previous rescue because obviously I rescue houses and then find loving homes. And obviously it does not use for Joey because it's pink and be a bit of it having pink because he's a boy. 
Then I have his TV, obviously. Then we have two spare water bottles. Again, if his one breaks, future hamsters or rescue hamsters. So I always have spares in. Then we got another hamster bowl like Joey has, and this is for my future hamster. Then we got Joey's spare bowl. And then we have this is all the rescue's hamster bowl, just a spare plastic one. Need to replace that for babies. Then we have two spare hamster bowls when I need them for rescues again. And then I have these which were well, used as hamster bowls, but I don't, I'd rather use them for sand bowls or sand bars actually. So just put that all back. And I'll show you the toys and treats next. So, this is all the toys that I have. In there, you can just see the cardboard tunnel from Wilco's, his ball, ball which needs cleaning, I thought it was good to pee in it. That stupid ladder that goes for the Alaska, which I kept with the shelf that's in storage. The spare Savic wheel, which is again not used, but good to have spare. And a hamster house that Jerry doesn't like and broke. Well, he takes the top off it anyway. Then this is the toy drawer. There's not, I don't think there's that much. I need to get some more. We have the crinkle tunnel that needs replacing because it's been two to pieces. It was Marley's one, my first hamster. Stick and nut tree. A coconut house which Joey actually loves. And we just have a small ball rush ball for the feature hamster. A double act two in one dental chew and treat, which Joey hasn't taken any notice of. It's not unusual because he doesn't chew things. And this is the one he's supposed to have and doesn't chew. Then we have the small play sticks from Woodlands for the feature hamster again. Have some Antos dog chews, ones for the feature hamster, and one that one is Joey's previous one that he chewed. Then I just have some Wilco small nibble, nibble sticks, which Joey does like. He chewed the strawberry one, which is very rare for him. Then we just have the flying saucer. I need to get a bigger one, but he doesn't like it anyway. He doesn't know what to do on it. And the stand for it. Then I just have the small carrot Noras. One of the leaf core shoes, and there's another one there. There might be another one somewhere as well. Normal stick, which is the wooden ones, and then we have some kiwi ones. Joey's bed, which is only used for um, playtime and supervision, obviously. One, one of the hamster play stick, uh, play uh, hamster time books that hasn't been used. Then we've got the tunnel, which is the Anko tunnel. Someone remind me of the name because I've forgotten it. It's the one that extends and I can't keep it in this cage for very long because he's already chewed a massive hole in it. He likes to chew everything he's not supposed to, basically. Then he's got his plastic seesaw with the stand somewhere. One of the pizza chews, which is these ones, which are the fun food dinner delights very keen on those either. Then we have the Toys from Trees too, which is the future hamster and Joe will be getting one soon. A chew that he's chewed. His old hamster time book that's been chewed to pieces. Then we got his small ball rush ball. We got the leafy teddy which is not being used. Another one of those dental act and chews. And another woodland stick. 
and that's all the toys. Next we go on to the treats, which I don't actually have many of, because I chucked a few out. I have done a treat video when I had all of them. And this is just um, some of them. Obviously he doesn't get them every day. And they are varied. Just the Vitacraft Ravilos. I think that's what they're called. I quite like those. A lot of these haven't even been opened yet. So I've um, waiting for storage, which I do now have some storage boxes to put them in. There's a Woodlands Rodent Garnish. Then we have the Supreme Stickles, which is Alpaline Cranberry. He has one currently in his cage. Then in here we have... I think it's some of the Wag Biscuits, the Woolco's Fruity Biscuits, and there's some Banana Chips, which I took out of his old food, because it was actually in his food mix, which is not good. It should only be used as a treat. food bag clips. We have the fruit and veg feast from Wilco's. We have the Asda Hero Dog Treats of Farmyard Friends, which he actually does really like. We have the pedig pedigree chewy bars. I do need to actually get some more dog treats and possibly no more seed treats, which you'll see now because I had quite a few. I have the Burgess Superstar treat, which I was sent. Now the Wilco's Two Honey treats, Wilco's Carrot treat, the Naturals Carrot and Fennel sticks. Apple, berry and banana cubes, they all have guinea pigs and rabbits, which I would never give them to. Then we have a seed nut. That's it for my, um, all my house supplies. Um, okay, see you in my next video, bye.